this is my great grandfather, Henry John Caulfield, who came to McLennan County in 1851. In 1936, my parents were dating, and it was the year of the Texas Centennial and they went to the state fair. They were handed a postcard, and on the front was a sketch of this house that they just toured with a floor plan, and they took it with them as a souvenir. They married on Christmas Eve in 1938, bought a lot, and started building the house that we have today. That's the construction mm -hmm. that was begun in 1939. This is after it was finished. The house was cutting edge, long and low, linear. The windows, panes. the panes, they're turned sideways and they're horizontal. It was built for good cross ventilation, lots of southern exposure. This is the release of the lien. They borrowed $3,300. The payments were $18.78. Because they were able to rent it out during the war to the head of the ordnance plant, uh, they paid it off in November of 1945, which is pretty amazing. They did an addition in 1952, and what it really is, now that the term has been coined, it's open concept. Who knew <laughs> in 1952? Um, that the den and the kitchen all flow. It's, it's totally, totally open. And they lived there for 63 years until they had to move to the nursing home. So it was empty for about 10 years. We decided we couldn't let it go. Common sense says don't take this project on, but your heart wants to. When you buy a house and decide to redo it, you really don't know totally what you're getting into. That was not the case. We knew everything, all the steps that had it had gone through. We have the original blueprints. It was a labor of love and it was a lot of labor to, <laughs> to, to redo electrical plumbing and the floors needed to be redone. It seemed like uh, it was completely covered in wallpaper. We had to take all that off. It was a uh, shiplap. It had never been sheetrocked. So it was still shiplap, canvas nailed into the shiplap, and then paper over that. And we completely redid the kitchen. So there was a lot of work involved. We, we're really pleased with the final result. I think you could say that, that the Caulfield House is, is for sure uh, an early fixer-upper. Mm -hmm.